What's up, YouTube? Welcome back to the living room. We're the October. So if you're new here, man, I encourage you to go check out our playlist. We were reacting to all the Marvel movies, but yeah, Captain Marvel. A lot of mixed reviews on this one, guys. We're going into this with an open mind. If you want more content, man, you can hit us up on Patreon, like, subscribe, uh, turn on notifications so you won't miss an upload. Got anything you want to add? Nope. Other than that, it just came out in 2019, and um, we've never met her before, so right. it's going to be an origin story, I think. So guys, I didn't want to get any spoilers, but I wanted to know if Stanley had passed away before this movie came out. I'm not exactly sure, but if he did, rest in peace to him. I'm not exactly sure but i'm really hoping we get to see him in this movie because i'm hoping that the last one wasn't the last one so right. all right guys let's go let's see what all the commotion's about let's go oh what <laughs> maybe it is so i guess probably yeah man that sucks but you know instead of being sad why not celebrate i mean so many people pass and you know they don't leave behind something for so many people to appreciate and ultimately to be brought together by and this was sucks man thank you stan thank Great. you stan <laughs> Green blood, okay. She's a Martian. Where is she? Okay, she was obviously in space. But she was on a, another planet, I think, right? I haven't seen that in America. So if you're not in America, you're in space? <laughs> no. Not on Earth. <laughs> Outside of Earth is space, is it? Whoa. Well, she has to be in space. There's a lot of hexagons in space. Maybe she's not in space. She's just on a different planet. Space would be like out of the atmosphere. Yeah, you know what I mean. That's, <laughs> you have to jump on space to get there, though. Kree. Uh, we know Kree. Yeah, we do. From Guardians. Do you know what time it is? Can't sleep. Dreams again. Want to fight? <laughs> <laughs> Tell me about this dream. Anything new? No. You have to let go of the past. I don't remember my past. It's causing you doubt, and doubt makes you vulnerable. Oh. Control it. Okay, I see. She's got magma hands. There's nothing more dangerous to a warrior than emotion. Humor is a distraction. <laughs> what? Uh, anger. Anger only serves the enemy. <gasps> she failed. <laughs> wow. Okay, so she's trying to learn how to control herself. Is anyone seen what the supreme intelligence really looks like isn't kree where yondu is from yeah i think so the kree worship oh look they're blue the conscious chooses the way they appear to us it's sacred i know yondu. it's personal <laughs> you saw my whip yeah how what is the point of giving me these if you don't want me to use them i want you to use them the supreme intelligence gave me responsibility of showing you how to use them i know how yeah, if that were true you'd better knock me down without them control your impulses stop using this start using this so she was given that Oh, is it about to be them gold people? The leader of the Kree. Is that the gold people? I don't know. What? Oh, I don't know about that, boys. A little too much. That is so cool. So she linked her consciousness there. Interesting. That's what you put together with that? Hmm? Oh. She's in a higher dimension now. We've seen that star somewhere. Your commander insists that you're fit to serve. You struggle with your emotions with your past which fuels them. You are just one victim of the scroll expansion that has threatened our civilization for centuries. <laughs> Sorry, his ears. So much that you do not. It's all blank, my life. You're supposed to take the form of who I most admire, but I don't even remember who this person was to me. Put your, Put your people's, people's needs before your own. We've given you a great gift, the chance to fight for the good of all Kree. I want to serve. Then master yourself. What was given can be taken away. Then you're going to be ordinary. I won't let you down. We'll know soon enough. Hey, was that, well was that star honor. what Nick Fury sent? It looked like that. It looked like a snowflake. Yeah, but I don't think it was that. So she was saying basically everyone's been harmed in the past. Get over it. Quit using your emotions. Learn to control them. And that's what's holding her back. Hey, we've seen him in Guardians of the Galaxy. Has the scroll ever summed you? Once. It was deeply disturbing. Why? Because I stared into the face of my mortal enemy and the face staring back was my own. You're more attractive, then it would be less disturbing. You think you're funny, <laughs> but I'm not laughing. You never laugh. I laugh on the inside. <laughs> Prepare for a search and rescue of our spy. The scrolls have invaded yet another border planet, this time Torfa. Solar sent us a warning the signal was intercepted. His cover's blown. The scroll general Talos has sent kill units to find him. Whoa. The accusers will bomb a scroll stronghold here in the south. We locate Solar 
and we get out. Proceed with caution. Follow protocol before extracting him. This is a dangerous mission. We must all be ready to join the collective if that is our fate today. For the good of all Kree. The good of all Kree. If they're Kree, why aren't they blue too? Yeah, you know what I'm saying? That's some good questions you ask, girl. See, Appreciate you know those. you're in space when there's hexagons. I'm telling you. They're hiding their planet with some technology, obviously, to mask and cloak it. Yeah, with hexagons. And it's a one-way, it's a one-way entrance. You gotta have the code to get in. You can fly out. But what shape do they go through? I don't think that's the right question. <laughs> a hexagon. Oh. Did it just go in the mud? Oh no, that's good. Whoa. <gasps> they look so scary. <gasps> I never realized how much of Marvel was just suits and technology. You know, I thought it was just always like superhero powers. Superhero powers, yeah. yeah. That you don't know you, how you inherited them. You just might or, or you look might at the, not. Look at these weapons you're using. Like that's so much of what the series. And it's pretty cool. Minerva? Do you read me? Anybody copy? Repeat. This is a perfect spot for an ambush. Only one way in, only one way out. We can get past the locals. So we don't know if they are locals. You don't have to go with me. I'll go alone. No, you won't. <laughs> we keep a close radius. We lose comms. We meet back at the helium. Come on. Atlas, you getting this? Remember, he's the one that saw Star Lord with that ball, and he's it. Yeah, yeah, yeah. He's absolutely. the one who like he pulled up to rescue it, basically. Yeah, <laughs> he's trying to kidnap it. Yeah, <laughs> which begs the question: Is Star Lord and this girl going to become a thing? They're going to meet each other. They have common friends. Does anybody copy? I hope not. Why? Because oh, I love Gamora. Gamora. Well, she gone? I don't want to hurt. Is this after that? I don't know. Stay back. Don't do it. They're locals. I found two dead. No green. They're just starving. Oh, because there's multiple. There you go. Little shapeshifters. That's what they do? Yeah, do you see the chin on that thing? HGX 78. RT 79. Get back. Whoa. Good shot. Scrolls! Oh, so they are. Mm -hmm. All of them are scrolls. And they had a lot of snarls. Yeah, they did, didn't they? Mm. Oh my god. I love how vibrant these movies are, though. Yeah, it's cool. This one's like Guardian of the Galaxy, obviously. That's what they're going for, but. Incoming! How did you know? How about I tell you my secret when you tell me yours? Oh my gosh, it's a British scroll. <laughs> <laughs> no offense to y'all across the pond, man. Y'all my brothers and sisters. I just didn't expect them to be British or whatever. I know. Like I want some fish and chips real bad. Right. Where are we? Stand by. Doesn't she look like she's in the US right now? I don't know. She looks like Tom Cruise. Higher, further, faster, baby. That's right. Oh no, please tell me she doesn't do like an Amelia Earhart move and fly to space. Oh no. This can't be right. Wait, what just happened? Go back even further. Oh. So fast. Need to go slow. That thing did some damage, didn't it? But she's okay. Who is this person? You let him drive. Let me try something. Wrong enough. Oh. Bro, she's trying a little too hard, though. You do know why they call it a cockpit, don't you? Ever thought about that? Huge rumble throughout the cosmos shook the moon and the sun and the stars and the sky. Did you see her? She's on the way. Get your butts inside. It's time to eat. Charming memory. Hang on. I think I got it. This is shot so cool. Aww. Zeus likes you. Wonderful view, isn't it? I prefer the view from up there. Wait, wait, wait. That's her. Get her back. Stand by. Oh, that's the lady who. Took the form of the greater intelligence. Right. And she or was, and she it was said the person she, she admires most right. or something like that. Said on my shirt. I couldn't read it. Wonderful view, isn't it? I prefer the view from up there. Mm -hmm. if there's Focus. Enough base, Look if there's down. Enough base. Pegasus. Dr. Wendy Lawson. That's her. Pegasus. Got it. Whoa, that was crazy. Interesting. They had to go through like all her memories. Hold on. Go back right before this. No now let me see where you're headed. Right, look at the coordinates. Focus. That's it. You're almost there. Don't fight it. Get her 
Whoa, she ejected. Wow. Oh my gosh. So she's trying to create false memories and he's not letting her. Oh, look at them toes. Them toes are long as hell. <laughs> Don't eat. Lawson is our oh. of that high speed engine. And everything we're out. Oh, that did something. <laughs> he just pushed her forehead. Oh, she's getting mad. Do you see that? Oh my gosh. Nice. She looks like that little blue boy from the video game back in the day. Y'all know what I'm talking about. Let me know. What did you do Whoa. to me? What did you put in my head? Nothing that wasn't already there. Those aren't my memories. Isn't that Volkanowski? We're looking for the location of a Dr. Lawson and her light spin engine. Why is she in your head? Oh. <laughs> <laughs> she went bowling on him. <laughs> Why are her hands cannons right now? That's what I'm saying. What is his name? Astro Boy or something like that? You know what I'm talking about? No. Maybe you don't have to even play all this stuff. I didn't play Astro Boy. You guys wouldn't happen to know how these things come off, would you? No? Fine. She's kind of funny. A little bit. She's all right. <laughs> that was funny. <laughs> no, because they've been like messing with her head and all this crap. Hmm. <laughs> <that. laughs> She's giving me like Captain America vibes though. You know, Captain America just sort of has like a- He's like kind of a dull, but like uh. Well, she's got more personality than him though, for sure. Captain America's still, I love him though. Fire. What? How is she gonna get out of this? <laughs> so I'm just really confused about her because I don't know like if any of that was true. <laughs> What? Any of that flashback she had or anything, if those were true or not. Those little things are like grunts from Halo. <laughs> you know why they call it. She said, yes, we know, we know. <laughs> <laughs> you living so soon, we're just gonna know each other. Didn't she just prove that he's no match for her? Yeah. Then why is he talking? Just keep shooting. Look, now you're blown up on a ship. You got all that to say. <laughs> well, maybe right. he'll get it off from one of those little like... Nah, we headed to Earth now. We're gonna enter in the atmosphere, burning up. You better put that suit back on. I'm curious to know where this is at in terms of Infinity Wars. Right, the Taiwan? Yeah, like if she goes to Earth, what if like no one's here? There we go. She's Blockbuster. Oh my gosh, I love that place. That's nostalgic. Except the fines when you got for not rewinding it. Some of y'all might not even know what that is. <laughs> y'all young ones. So she must be in the past. This must be like before. It was just called C something. It's not called Earth. It was called C something. Oh, okay. <laughs> Beers to Star Force Command. Do you read me? Do you copy? What movie are you picking up? Didn't know that one. <laughs> <laughs> what do you even think of her when you see her? <laughs> Hi, I'm Beers, Kree Star Force. Is this C-53? Do you understand me? Is my universal translator working? I understand you. Good. Are you in charge of security for this district? <laughs> the, the movie theater has its own guy. <laughs> Where can I find communications equipment? This reminds me of Thor when they're just speaking old. Bring Radio me a Shack. horse. Radio Shack. That's where she's going to get communication. She's about to go bust through the window. He's going to watch her. He told her to do it. Look at these washed up Cree. <laughs> Literally. <laughs> Literally. What in the dickens are those? Oh. oh he's going to turn into that girl. They're just turning into surfers. Track the pod. Find the girl. <laughs> she knows more than she knows. Hey, this one's taken. <laughs> Game Boy. Come on. Verify. CTC 39. GRX V1600. I'm fine. Thank you for asking. She got it working. <laughs> I thought we'd lost you. Did you find Solar? It wasn't Solar. Talos simmed him. Even knew his code. That's impossible. <gasps> that code was buried in his unconscious. Scrolls messed with my He's mind. He's creeping up back there. I think it's how they extracted Solar's code. I'm on planet C53. The scrolls are looking for someone named Lawson. That's gotta be Earth. Radio Shack and what Buster? Unless they just scoped out Earth and copied it. And this has to be in the 90s if there's a blockbuster. They think that she's cracked the code on light speed tech. I have to get to her before they do, or else they'll be able to invade new galaxies. No. Wow, do you get that? They cracked the code on light speed tech, so the universe expands faster than the speed of light, which is why we have the observable universe. We'll never know it lies beyond the observable universe. Due to the fact that it expands faster than light, so we'll never be able to see. But if they get the technology to move faster than light, they'll be able to travel the cosmos indefinitely and basically like checkmate. If the scrolls got to her, she's compromised. Okay, great. Don't know. 
Maybe you know what I'm talking about. Ever been to C53? It's a real shithole. <laughs> <laughs> As the cops are going crazy back there. The stakes are high on this one, y'all. You call this in? Is that Phil? Is it? <gasps> it's oh, Phil. Oh, let's go. Yeah. Young. Is that him? Bro, I don't know. He was so young looking. I don't know the timeline. But he had Phil vibes. Yeah, yeah. You know what I'm saying? Beacon activated. I could feel like it was Phil. Excuse me, man. Yep, it was Phil. You know anything about a lady blowing a hole through the roof of that blockbuster over there? <laughs> Witness says she was. Is that Nick? Crazy. Yeah. His eye, he still has it. That's what I'm saying, baby. This is like, you're right. This is like early. I'd like to ask you some questions. Can I see some identification, please? Veers, Cree Star Force. Veers, mm -hmm. Star Force. How long you plan to be in town? Oh, I'll be out of your hair as soon as I track down the scrolls that are infiltrating your planet. <laughs> scrolls? They can transform to any life form down to the DNA. Whoa, 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 so this whoa, is so whoa. early on, they don't even know. How do we know you're not one of those Jake Congratulations, Agent Fury. You have finally asked a relevant question. <laughs> You're under arrest. <laughs> what do they even know? Like, what do you even say? <laughs> you know, that could have been the first event. Wait, is this be this is before this is after Cap? So they already have super soldiers at this point. Doesn't mean he's ever seen anything seen like it. I did not. But that was like it until 2008. He said I did not. Did you see that? Well, Owen Wilson. Who's that? Oh, it was just a surfer because they cloned into surfer. <laughs> <laughs> I forgot. Man, she kind of like Spider Man right there. Suspect on northbound train in pursuit. So they're normal cops right now. They're not shield, right? Right. It looks like they're just FBI or something. <laughs> Maybe they form all that later. Maybe they see this girl and they're like, there's something crazy going on. Damn. Aww. Oh, oh, <laughs> she's seen that old lady. <laughs> it said, Ooh. Oh, my <laughs> gosh. <laughs> oh, my God. Whoa. Yeah, she looks like such a bad person for just beating up an old lady. <laughs> but that old lady's dropping her back. Like, what are you supposed right. to do about that? Bro, what is that? It looks like something that's operated by the Power Stone, right? The purple? One of the Infinity Stones? Yeah, the purple is the Power Stone, I think. Oh. <laughs> Look at him. I'm not even gonna lie, dude. In movies, when people chase trains, like in cars, and they're like all on the bridges and stuff, I'm just like, there's just no way you're keeping up with that train. No. Nah. I'll take it one red light and you're lost. <laughs> Heading for a tunnel up ahead. Let's greet them at the station. Dang. Security, this is Agent Coulson. I'm still here at the Blockbuster. <gasps> oh. Yeah, I was wondering because I was like, oh wait, then who's that in the car? I didn't even think about it. I was right. just like. Oh, that was violent right there. <laughs> They're all like, what does this girl got on? <laughs> oh, don't hit him. <laughs> and the man's like, what the? It's funny she knows if it's them just by acting like she's going to punch him. Doesn't she just look so goofy, though, walking around like that to yeah. everyone? Is that his eye? Nah, he's fine. Yeah, he's not used to all that. <laughs> he's gonna protect that that evidence. Official shield activity. Stay back. Oh, so he's with shield already. That's what's up. Why is he acting all shot for? Maybe to trick us. Maybe, maybe to trick the viewer. Well, maybe because they formed shield and they understood, you know, super soldiers, earth technology, but they didn't understand the vastness of the cosmos and how relevant all that could be to their operation. Like they thought it was just like an earth thing. Right. Yeah, for sure. Then they realized it was just domestic. Then now it's foreign and domestic. Look at that old Google, bro. I bet then I didn't even try with computer. Did you see how funny she looked typing it in? <laughs> He's like, what is a bug? Nice scuba suit. Hell on wheels. There's Todd. Lighten up, honey, huh? Got a smile for me? Might get punched in the head, bro. But who does that? Yeah, jacket. He don't need it. Oh, she she found an outfit from a mannequin. 
<laughs> all life on Earth carbon based, not this guy. Ew. What is he? If we saw those in Mexico, I would be like a little like scared. Mm -hmm. Yeah, them paper mache projects in Mexico for real. <laughs> this thing looked like Colson. Talk like him too. When he said that there were word she used was infiltration i got word on a motorcycle thief that fits her description she can tell us why these lizards are here maybe she can tell us how to kick them to the curb do it alone no can't trust anyone we can't trust you either i don't like you you know what i'm saying <laughs> what? they're ugly bastards aren't they <laughs> he's no brad pitt sir could you imagine if we discovered aliens, guys, and like, you know what I'm saying? They were cool. You know, we liked them, but they stunk. <laughs> like, if they stunk, we just would not mess with aliens. Bro. Like, <laughs> it really don't matter how smart they are, what they have to offer. If they stink, forget it. I wouldn't get too close there, boss. Oh, is he one of them? Yeah, he's mourning the death of his homie right now. Does she have a memory flashes there? Oh, yeah, that's where they were at the bar telling her she's a girl and she's up. Why are they doing that to her? Or why was she there? <laughs> that's the more important question. That's the symbol she needs. What can I get you? Where's Pegasus? That's classified. <laughs> Did you have a rough day, Agent Fury? It was cool. <laughs> Got to watch an alien autopsy. Typical nine to five. <laughs> it's gonna get a little awkward, but I gotta ask. You think I'm one of those green things. You are looking at 100% red-blooded Earth man. Afraid I'm gonna need proof. We talking cheek swab or urine sample? Where were you born? Huntsville, Alabama, but technically I don't remember that part. Name your first pet. Mr. Snoofers. Mr. Snoofers. That's what I said. Did I pass? Not yet. <laughs> the Cold War, we were everywhere. Belgrade, Budapest. I like the bees. I can make them rhyme. <laughs> Been riding a desk for the past six years, trying to figure out where our future enemies are coming from. Never occurred to me they would be coming from above. Right. Right. I'm a detail so bizarre, a scroll could never fabricate it. Toast is cut diagonally. I can't eat it. That's the only way I like to eat it. You didn't need that, did you? No. No, I didn't. But I enjoyed it. <laughs> Prove you're not a scroll. <laughs> <laughs> photon blast a scroll can't do that <laughs> whoa so she's blasting pure light energy out of her hand photon blast some tlc boy and you're a priest a race of noble warriors heroes what do scrolls want with dr lawson they believe that she developed a light speed engine at pegasus i used to think this song said go go jason waterfalls Raises jason waterfalls right i thought that was his name i swear i was a kid <laughs> like a little kid i know a rogue soldier when i see one we got a personal stake in this he's a rogue soldier okay so we know that much but how that's what we don't know nicholas joseph fury agent of shield place your thumb on the pad one moment nicholas joseph fury everybody calls me fury not nicholas not joseph not nick that's about to change it's gonna be director it's cool he's a character in this one yeah i kind of love that because he's been absent lately which he, sucks yeah because in the first couple we, it was like he was like a big part of yeah. it. yeah he was the captain but essentially director but yeah but you know what i mean he was like you know it in felt charge. like he was in charge yeah he was the honcho does uh, announcing your identity on clothing help with the covert part of your job Said the space soldier who was wearing a rubber suit <laughs> lose the flannel you see that plane right there, babe? Mm -hmm. That thing probably hasn't been shown to the public yet at this point. The stealth bomber? Probably. Because they had that thing for like 20 or 30 years before the public ever saw it. I remember one time my dad got a pager at the flea market when I was a kid. <laughs> they used to sell them there. I think my parents skipped that. I don't remember them having one. Oh, he's lifting the fingerprint off that? Oh, yeah. Smart. You should see what I can do with a paper clip. <laughs> <laughs> oh what's that called a calico or something a little orange kind a tabby yeah, what's your name huh goose cool name for a oh he said cool name for a cool cat <laughs> i'll be doing that to that cat too get my fingerprint out let me unravel this puppy with <laughs> You sat there and watched me play with tape and all you had to do was <laughs> I mean that leaves evidence though. Now they're gonna know someone was there. Whoa. My biggest fear is to walk in a room that has a light like that. Like it just keeps going? Yes. That kind of gives me like Lord of the Rings vibes that for some reason. No, nah, that gives me I'm not supposed to be there in that facility vibes. That was her cat though, so she's here, right? Wendy? Lawson's plan for the light speed engine. I wonder where they terminated the project. Maybe because she's cuckoo. Nah, there's a method to that madness. Yeah, there you go. Lawson is not Cuckoo. She's Cree. What? Crashed the Aces aircraft doing an unauthorized test flight. Took a pilot down with her. Oh, and your light speed engine? It's toast. Six years ago, 1989. Who was the pilot? Oh, okay. So it's 95 right now. There is a testimonial here from uh, Maria Rambo. Last person to see them a lot. That girl's in her memories. Mm -hmm. Her friend, right? They're like, come on, girl. We about to fly this plane. Mm -hmm. That girl. Higher, faster, stronger than the boys. <laughs> <laughs> right. 
Oh, they, they're censoring everything. She saw herself. This isn't about fighting war, it's about ending them. Oh. So this lady knew a little something. I know Lawson was Cree. She was here on C-53 and died in a plane crash. I just discovered a mission report sent from C-53. There's only so much I'm cleared to tell you, Veers. Nah, share it. Lawson was an undercover Cree operative named Marvell. Marvell. Marvel. Experimenting with tech that apparently could help us win the war. Question her alone. Nick Fury and it's awesome. Work, Nicholas. How you know his name like that? Yeah, why him, are you calling he, him Nicholas? He specifically said everyone calls him Fury. So that it's a DNA bot or whatever they're called, Squirrel. I knew her and I knew her as Lawson. It sounds like Scroll simulation. No, it's not because I remember. Do not let your emotions override your judgment. She's on sub level six. I'll get off on five. Take the stairs in case she makes a run for it. Pencil move like we did in Havana. We did in Havana. Oh. Lion. Oh, so he knows. He yeah, knows. Yeah, because they wanted to know Havana. Get him, Nick. He didn't come. Fury's colluding with the target. Then why would he call us in? Do we take him into dead or alive? Whoa. Yeah. So the Kree's infiltrated the whole the whole organization at this point. Is that what's happening here? I think so. Go, go, go. Smart. Was it something I said? Golly, hit him with a spinning elbow. <laughs> Aww. Dang, he really threw it at him, too. Mm -hmm. <laughs> He's trying to knock him out with it. Oh, them Kree's strong, huh? Mm -mm. <laughs> I don't like when they do my boy like that. <laughs> that was a photon blast. Good job, Veers. She said. <laughs> Got a blast. <laughs> Is that really Colson? Ask him something. Colson, you have eyes on him? Just try up there. I knew I liked you, Colson. That's why we like Phil the long way. Absolutely. Your communicator, you obviously can't be trusted with it. <laughs> she confiscated the pager. I've seen that before in one of these movies. That jet? How about not? Guys, let me know what that's from. Shoot back. Oh, they're gonna close the gate, ain't they? Nope. <laughs> they're wide wrong. open. You're just super wrong. <laughs> There's a cat in there. Goose came. Oh. <laughs> <laughs> that poor kitty cat. Oh. Who's a good kitty? Huh, Goose? Oh. Hey, you might not can trust that cat. That could be a Cree. It's gonna infiltrate. Funny story. I arrived on Hala near dead. No memory. That was six years ago. So you think you were the pilot that went down with Dr. Lawson? Last person to see them alive? Probably tell us. Maria Rambo. So how do we get to Louisiana? Hey, I need to go find her. That agent that stopped the scrolls from finding us? Colson, the new guy. Guess he doesn't hate me yet. Yeah, well, give him time. <laughs> I guess he had a feeling. Went with his gut against the orders. What keeps us human? I get in trouble for that. Yeah, so that is who Nick Fury contacted. Right. Yeah, yeah, for sure. When he disappeared. V is the tall fella. Kidnap her. Give us the <gasps> Oh, we already know how you am, buddy. What's his name, dude? I forgot, but he was a bad villain, dude. He was awesome. Sell of scrolls anywhere is a threat to Kree everywhere. Dang, what is his name? I know it too. It's gonna get on my nerves. It's like Krogon or something like that. Because he was their like adopted dad. The girls. Gamora and Nebula's Kron or something. Bruh. That might be it, yeah. Excuse me, I'm looking for Maria Rambo. Look and save the day. <laughs> Mom, it's Auntie Carol. Carol. That's overwhelming. Everyone said you were dead. Who are you? But we knew they were lying. I'm not really who you think I am. That is the craziest shit I ever heard. Green transforming <laughs> aliens? There's no such thing. You are absolutely right, young lady. There's no such thing. Because if there were, we would want to keep that to ourselves. <laughs> <laughs> um, maybe I would have started with that. I don't know. Maybe I'd have listened harder. Oh, she can do a lot more than make tea with those hands. <laughs> I kept all your stuff. I'll go get it. You don't remember anything? If I could just piece together what happened that morning, maybe it'll all make sense. You woke me up. Back then, we had to get up so early. The Air Force still wasn't letting women fly combat. Testing Lawson's planes was our only shot at doing something that mattered. You wanted to race to base in your old Mustang. You cheated, took a shortcut. Since when was a shortcut cheating? Since it violates the predetermined rules of engagement. When I got to the hangar, Lawson was agitated. She was trying to take the aces up herself, but you said There's that- There were lives at stake. I would fly the plane. Yeah, 
The doc was always unique. Father liked her. You're saying she's from another planet. <laughs> I know this must be hard for you. you know what's hard is losing my best friend in a mission so secret they act like it never even happened. Yeah, that's kind of tough, man, for real. And now you come up in here after six years. We're just supercharged by our hands and you expect <laughs> me to call you. I don't even know what fears. Is that really who you are? It's not really her fault, right? Maybe she just doesn't believe the story. Nah, she believes the story. She's just hurt. She's hurt because she just didn't want us to be that way. She's just overwhelmed. I forgot your jacket. Mom does not let me wear it anymore after I spilled ketchup on it. Oh, she's adorable. That was all that survived the crash. Her dog tag. They can change into anyone. Hi there. What do you want? Tom, this is my friend, Carol. Oh, pleased to meet you. Yowzers. That electricity out here is no joke. Well, I noticed that peculiar bird you got parked by the road. I was just wondering if you mind if I bring the boys over to the I have to see the bird parked out by the road. You're really working overtime to sell this one, aren't you? Talos. <laughs> I'm sorry, Tom. This really isn't a good time. I'll come by tomorrow. Uh, oh, okay. You know, you really should be kind to your neighbors. You never know when you're going to need to borrow some sugar. How does what he do you know that? that? <laughs> oh, my God. <laughs> no one's gonna hurt the girl. Just don't kill me. And who is that out there? That's a fair point. I just want to talk. Last time we talked, I ended up hanging from my ankles. That was before I knew who you were. I have an audio recording from Pegasus of your voice from a plane crash six years ago. I believe you called. <laughs> 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 Can you stop? <laughs> was destroyed in the crash. <laughs> Sorry. How'd you get it? Young lady, I have a special skill that kind of allows me to get into places I'm not supposed to be. Call me young lady again. I'm going to put my foot in the place it's not supposed to be. Do I have my teeth? Am I supposed to guess where that is? Your, Your ass. ass. Okay, I get it. We're all a little on edge yeah. here. But look, I just need your help. If you sit down and you listen to this, it'll be worth it. Your while. Call your buddy back inside and I'll listen. Oh my god. Get that thing away. How'd they get in here? Are they scared of cats? The cat? That's not a cat. That's a flurkin. <laughs> a flurkin. <laughs> Why did it do that? I was like, that little girl has seen a lot today. <laughs> I remember when computers were like that. <laughs> They're all just waiting. <laughs> What's happening? <laughs> Loading. Punch in the coordinates. Five two two nine negative four seven. Copy that. Where are we going, Doc? My laboratory. Dang! It took that long to load some audio. <laughs> oh no. Wait, what is that? It's not showing up on my radar. Go, Carol. Fly. That's no Mig Larson. Who the hell are they? Those are the bad guys. Fly faster now. <laughs> what do they want? Me. My work. I never should have brought you along. Here comes some G's. I would hate to be a passenger in one of those planes. They're firing backwards. Hold on. Maybe. Luckily for you, I don't think you will be. No, I'm talking about like that lady's the passenger back there. Heck no. Right. Nah. Oh, because you're so out of control? Yes. Right. Bail out, bail out. Oh, yeah, that was in her. Oh, it didn't work. In her memories. It's the trees. I can see why they thought they all died. Yeah, I copy. We hit ground. Yeah. Dang, she's completely fine. Doc? Dang, whipping her neck around. <laughs> she was just in a plane crash, bro. Oh, it's blue. How's my hair? <laughs> Help me out. I don't know. I'd be freaking out if you had some blue blood. Remember her blood is blue at the beginning? Right. Could have been a false memory. It could have been her blood she was really seeing. What is for? To end wars? There's red right there. But the wars are bigger than you know. Damn it. My name is not Lawson. My real name is Marvell, and I come from a planet called Hollow. I would say that you're delusional, but we just got shot down by a spaceship and your blood is blue. <laughs> Spent half my life fighting a shameful war. Remember the coordinates, okay? You gotta save them without me. I gotta blow this engine before they find it. <gasps> what? Who shot? It was green. It was a green shot. Oh, it's her, probably that guy from her memory who's holding the gun. No. No interest in hurting you. The energy core. Where is it? Para rescues on the way. And I see no reason to prolong this conversation. No, wait. You mean that energy core? That's how she got her powers. Oh my god. Wow, what a compulsive decision. She just shoot that thing. <laughs> Jesus, you could destroy the earth here. <laughs> <laughs> like, you know what I'm saying? Jeez. <laughs> <laughs> Look at 
at her her molecular structure. Oh being, my gosh, she looks crazy. Calibrated. It's like she got hit with some chug splash off Fortnite. Some electronic kind. Permission to fire. Hold your fire. <laughs> she looks cool. Has been destroyed. There's the other half. Right. She absorbed its power. She's coming with us. Well, that's kind of cool. That's kind of cool how all that happened. Right. If I ever see a molecular power structure, I'm just not going to shoot it. Well, I am if I turn into like a superhero and yeah, save everybody. My luck, I would just get cancer though. <laughs> Everything that I knew was a lie. Yonrog killed Marvel because she found out that she was on the wrong side of an unjust war. Your people are terrorists. I saw the ruins on Torfa. Ruins that the accusers are responsible for. Homeless. Ever since we resisted Kree rule and they destroyed our planet. The handful of us that are left will be slaughtered next. Less you help me finish what Marvel started. That's like the oblivion action going on wait, with the Tom Cruise movie. You destroyed the engine. The core that powered it is in a remote location. If you help us decode those coordinates, we can find it. Are you trusting him though? No. I'm not trusting nobody. You and I lost everything at the hands of the Kree. Can't you see it now? Not one of them. I don't know. Don't trust him. Yeah, I'm gonna go fight my own battles, bro. You I don't like how he's telling it. He's just too innocent. You are Carol Danvers. You are the woman on that black box risking her life to do the right thing. My best friend. Oh. Supported me as a mother and a pilot when no one else did. And you were the most powerful person I knew. Way before you could shoot fire from your fists. That was deep. We discovered that your energy signature matched Marvel's core. I just don't trust this guy. I just need your help. Those weren't coordinates. They're state vectors. If we track its course, we'll find it in orbit right now. It's just basic physics. <laughs> yeah, dum dum. Was that so difficult to figure out? I mean, you're my science guy, right? <laughs> <laughs> We've got to get to the core before he does. A few tweaks to your vessel should do it. Mm -mm. I could use a co-pilot. I can't leave Monica. It's okay. I can stay with Grandma and Papa. Your plan is to leave the atmosphere in a craft not designed for the journey, and you anticipate hostile encounters with a technologically superior foreign enemy, correct? That's what I'm saying. You have to go. <laughs> Find the coolest mission in the history of missions. And you're going to give it up to sit on the couch and watch Fresh Prince with me? <laughs> you should consider what kind of example you're setting for your daughter oh normally you would not want your mom to do that it sounds dangerous when they were handing out kids they gave her the toughest one lieutenant trouble you remembered but there is something that i need your help with i can't wear these cree colors anymore hmm? Whoa. no uh -uh. Definitely not. <laughs> i don't know i might have went with that one that one was cool oh okay that was cool how do i look Kind of like Iron Man. And Captain America. Fresh. <laughs> I like that one. What took you so long? A system is fallible as we've learned. Okay, then let's do this. Who do I see when I commune with the supreme intelligence? The person you most admire and respect, I'd guess. What is your earliest memory of Hala? A transfusion, blue blood running through my veins. It's my blood. It's coursing through her veins. Oh, wow. They tricked me because they were like snarky like her. You're done with her. You're too late. So all of a sudden, I just have to like these green things now. I don't know. Is he the bad guy now? I don't know, dude. I'm not buying his little story. Like, I'm so sorry. I'm way too tough hearted for that. Like, you're not about to just sit there and pull on my heartstring. You've been the enemy since the whole time. Ronan. Ronan. That's his name, right? For the good of all Kree, Commander. The infestation will be eradicated. So he's on the bad side of things. You really shouldn't have that thing on your lap. I love alliance with you. And as long as he continues to freak you out, I'm going to keep giving him all the love and hugs that he needs. <laughs> right. I'm with Nick Fury on this one. I know. Can you all do it? Physiologically? Yeah, but uh, it takes practice, dare I say, talent to do it well. Can you turn into a cat? <laughs> what about a filing cabinet? Why would I turn into a filing cabinet? <laughs> I'll give you 50 bucks right now if you turn to a Venus flat track. <laughs> What's he gonna do with 50 bucks? Is this normal space turbulence? Pretty much. Oh, yeah. He said no. He said no. <laughs> <laughs> trying to bring him out. It's their first time in space, both of them. Mm -hmm. The cat's been there. Artificial gravity on. Where is it? It's gotta be here. Dang, they about ran into it. Marvel's laboratory, pre Imperial cruiser. That's a cool shot. Yeah. Do you trust this guy? I don't know, man. I just still don't know. I mean, like, I'm not trying to be mean, but he looks like the Green Goblin, bro. Like, how can you trust him? It's not that I wouldn't trust him, but I'm not about to put myself at risk for you. There's a big old galaxy out there. You can go find somebody else. No, oh, there's the energy core. Mm -hmm. No kitty. 
In her notes, she called it the Tesseract. <gasps> tesseract. Why didn't I think that at first? That's silly me. I was lost in doing with all this kid stuff. The Yondu stuff. Oh my God, they put it in a lunchbox. <laughs> <laughs> Did he just summon them or what happened? Right. I couldn't tell if it was him making that noise. <laughs> that was weird. You know, is that what you're saying? Yeah. I guess it was. <laughs> His wife. So this was the truth. He was telling the truth. That lady saved them. He didn't come here for the Tesseract. Yeah, Pac-Man's still there. Aww. Marvel warned us not to send a signal for any reason. We did the right thing. I ain't yeah. believe I'm about to cry over some aliens. Like, right. She's all right. She's a friend. She let me to you. I'm so sorry. This is war. My hands are filthy from it too. The way he is now, he found my family. There are thousands of us separated from each other, scattered throughout the galaxy. What? <laughs> oh. He said, I practice all day. I playing pinball machine for six years. I'd have some high scores too. Me too. <gasps> uh oh. <gasps> Don't you dare. Got in her head. Just like we thought. Let him go. You can have me and the core. You lied to me. What's given can be taken away. That's what that thing is on her head. Okay, I get it now. Doesn't she just need the lunchbox? The Tesseract? Right. Do not hurt them. So her friend pops up after all this time, gives her a story, and then she just leaves her daughter to go do this. Ain't that crazy? It's the coolest mission show of her pilot. She's a pilot. There she is. Seems like your time on C-53 jogged the old memory. You hurt them. I will burn you to the ground. With what exactly? You didn't give me these powers. And yet you've never had the strength to control them on your own. That kind of reminds me of Thor Ragnarok with that little thing on your neck. Species, flirting, threat, high. Oh, it is a farkin. What is a farkin? <laughs> what they call cats? <laughs> oh, they're putting a muzzle on them. Aww. It's a cat, not Hannibal Lecter. <laughs> Species. Human male threat, low to none. <laughs> Check the others into space. Oh. Thanks to you, those insidious shapeshifters will threaten our borders no more. I used to believe your lies. You're talking about destroying them because they won't submit to your rule. And neither will I. We embraced you as our own. You stole me from my home, my family, my friends. What in the heck? She just tossed her with her face. It's cute how hard you try. Without us, you're weak. That's pretty fire she was doing stuff like that though, because not me. Helpless. We saved you. Without us, you're only human. You're right, I'm only human. She kind of sucks out a lot of stuff though. <laughs> like, I've never been knocked down that much. That was all that was left. She's trying to break out. So is she controlling it now? I've been fighting with one arm tied behind my back. But what happens when Oh. I'm finally set free? The Fonz, isn't that from Happy Days that we don't know who it is, but we've seen him in a lot of movies, like on the waterway? I've just heard of The Fonz, like I know who he is, but I don't think I've ever seen none of that. You know you're glowing. I'll explain it later. Take the Tesseract. I'm not touching that thing. You want me to get you an oven mitt? Oh, so it's a, really a flirking, it's Absolutely. not a cat. Absolutely, dude, it just ate the Tesseract. <laughs> get the scrolls on the quad jet and go. Take the flirkin with you. I'll buy you some time. Oh, good flirking. I'm trusting you not to eat me. Oh. Oh, hey guys. Wrestle for the Tesseract. I used to find you amusing. Let's put an end to this. Y'all didn't see her just level up and then y'all want to fight her? Y'all silly. <laughs> like Groot, kind of. He just ate him? <laughs> Yeah, I have to put that cat down. Mm. You would still hold on to that cat? Yeah, if Maybe it's you're weird. You. Your priorities are weird in this movie. 
<laughs> it's a Marvel movie. I know, but that cat's gotta go. No, I'm keeping it in the Marvel movie. <laughs> Is this I'm Just a Girl by Gwen Stefani? Right. You knew all along. Is that why we never hung out? No, I just never liked you. <laughs> <laughs> oh, she didn't understand a Nerf gun. <laughs> that was a good shot, though. <laughs> right on the forehead. She's so snarky when she fights that it's, it's hard to, like, think that she could lose. You know what I mean? Yeah. She's like the other superheroes. They all have a catchphrase, like, I could do this all day. Or... Right. Come on, do your thing. Come on. Come on. Damn it, Goose. Pick a side. <laughs> we'll blast them all into space. Play it cool. Just like a banner. Oh, okay, yeah, he knows him. Who's that, Colson? Mm -hmm. Maybe he said just he like just... Savannah. Oh no, it was that guy. This guy's kind of a weak bad guy too. I'm not even gonna lie. That guy. Do you think so? Is he kind of boring to you? I think mostly because I don't 100% grasp his motive. Cover her eyes. Ah! Onto the ship. Let's go. Oh, so he thinks it's really in there. Nice diversion. I could have swore I put it in there. <gasps> I don't know why that man was celebrating like he got away. Mm -hmm. Oh my god, I hope he makes it after all that. And she's about to have to fly by herself in space, having no idea. Take him down in the dropship. You alright, friend? Got a bogey coming in hot. So I guess that's how she breathes in space. That Is little that suit, helmet? right? Yeah, Star Lord has one like that, right? Mm hmm. With them fingertips burning up, proton blast. She better not hit the ground again. What? Yeah, they're probably sick in there. <laughs> nice. Oh, no. You know, I don't really like the way she looks at all in this suit. Like, I like her when she has, like, her face showing and all, but I don't like this tomahawk-looking suit she has with the mohawk and all that. Well, it's her helmet. Yeah, it's kind of weird. I don't like it. We could definitely do a redesign on that. Like, I don't know why she has to have a mohawk. That's Maybe what I don't it helps, get. like, propel it, like Yondu. I don't know. I think she was weird with it. Remember Yondu had a mohawk? The little thing he wore on his head? Deploy ballistic warheads. Right, but he was blue. <laughs> yeah, know? she's he free. Like an alien. Oh, wow. So she's going Iron Man on him. Perfect. Missile defense system right there. That's impossible. I hate that we're still dealing with Ronan. He's gone. That's not their defense system, Ronan. Take him down. I'm glad it wasn't Thanos or Solar. He's probably a doctor. Right. <laughs> Let's go. You know, for us to never hear, heard of her, she's awfully powerful. I know. I wonder why they kept her secret. Where was she at when we needed to kill Ronan? I guess we'll find out. Oh, she's like flicking them off. <laughs> Return to the jump point. We'll be back for the weapon. The core. The woman. So she just made him run off, huh? Fight another day, I guess. Now she's got to go fight this guy. Good choice. <laughs> I always told you he'll be ready the day you can knock me down as yourself. This is that moment, Beers. Destroy him. This just blow him up. You can beat me with that. Yeah, you don't need all that. I know for real. He just wants an advantage. She's got you, bro. I have nothing to prove to you. Man, I hope she was gonna zap him real quick with the hand. Tell the Supreme Intelligence that I'm coming to end it. The war. The lies. We can't do this. <laughs> that was a close call, huh, Goosey? 
<laughs> Don't make it mad. Oh my gosh. <gasps> that ain't how he loses his eye, is it? Just a scratch. No. Oh, a flurkin scratch is something different. Is that really how he lost his eye? That's crazy. From a kitty? Just in time. Some nifty flying you did out there. Jill could always use with the pilot. As long as you never call my flying nifty again. How's your eye? Better every second. Just so I'm clear, you were Solar and the S.H.I.E.L.D. agent? Tied my boss up, stole his identity. I borrowed his likeness of my face. Look at his jacket. <laughs> You're good to go here till you recover, but you and your family are going to need a new look. I'll help you find a home. They can stay here with us, can't they, Mom? They won't be safe here, baby. Auntie Carol is right. They need their own home. Yeah, I like him and all, but please get out of my house. That's a threat every day. <laughs> right. Keep the Tesseract on earth you sure that's what marvel would want it's two words marvel 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 sounds a lot better you know like the marvelettes <laughs> oh yes wait a minute mr postman <laughs> mr postman not ringing any bells keep singing maybe it'll come back to me there's that thing you gave him i upgraded it range should be a couple galaxies at least <laughs> emergencies only okay so it's basically like an advanced beeper in a way. Mm-hmm. Oh. <laughs> <laughs> oh, so she's helping them find a home. You got the ketchup stain off. Thanks, Lieutenant Trouble. Hmm. It's hard for me to say goodbye to. Okay. He's gone. She's so Dang. dramatic. <laughs> like what? <laughs> she doesn't need a mask right now? He died so slow. <laughs> Glad to have you back, sir. This came for you. <gasps> oh. So oh, he gets to pick one? That the Kree burned your eye out because you refused to give them the Tesseract? <laughs> I'm sorry to report that we still haven't found the Tesseract. He might as well act like a hero for it, right? I know. <gasps> I'll let you know when it's. No, nah, I'm getting rid of that thing. Mm -mm. We have no idea what other intergalactic threats are out there. Shield alone can't protect us. We need to find more. More weapons. More heroes. Get some rest, sir. We got a big decision to make. <laughs> Avenger initiative? Captain Marvel initiative? I think he changed it to the Avenger initiative. Yeah, I probably I could be did. wrong. Oh, this is where hers is going off. Whoa, look how many people. And Cap's watching that from where? This is a nightmare. I've had better nightmares. Yeah, <laughs> for real. So that thing just stopped doing whatever the hell it was doing. What did it got? Whatever signal it was sending finally crapped up. I thought we bypassed the battery. It's still plugged in. It just, just stopped. Reboot it. Send the signal again. Tell me the second you get a signal. I want to know who's on the other end of that thing. Whoa. Dang, she came right on the dot when she was needed. Captain Marvel returned in Avengers Endgame. <laughs> uh -uh. A hairball? Oh, was the tech? How do we not know that? Yeah, so dumb. I forgot it happened. The lining of that stomach, though. What's <laughs> up, so, Rocket? Just double I know, you just double check, double check. Just it always does the same where it won't let me scroll anymore. So that was Captain Marvel. Um, do you want to share your thoughts first? Or you want me to? You know, I'm a, I'm a lot more opinionated than you are. Yeah. So. Okay. I thought it was good. Like I have to kind of compartmentalize movies now in this like universe to right. be like superhero movies, and I have to remember that because in this one I had to remember that a lot. Like I'm just trying to understand. Like you know, in a lot of the superhero movies we've seen, I can like feel a connection with me and the main character because he's also he. It's a Ben and he every time. He's also a human in a way. Right. So like I can kind of like understand except for like, you know, well Star Wars is all human, so never mind. But like Well like, those movies were so good, it's hard not to it's fall hard to over compare those characters because those movies yeah. were awesome. I didn't think this was a great movie. I thought it was okay. I mean it was a good movie. You know, it was it was fun. It was necessary. I didn't think it was a cinematic masterpiece by any means. Mm. The whole Cree flipping thing and it turns out, oh, we're really the good guys with the propaganda. Like that would be cool with me, man, but they have to show that. You can't just every bad regime in the history of the world said that oh we're actually the good guys you know and so to me that was just really weird to me 
It just felt like I it was unnecessary. I think I know why I did that though, because I think Captain Marvel, the thing about her was she just was like very strung out on her emotions. Like, and that's what the guy even, the guy she's fighting with even portrayed that she can control stuff, but not her emotions. And I, I think with that being said, her emotions got her to do the right thing. Emotion and logic can lead you to the same place. But the more you watch the channel, the more you'll know, the more you cry and stuff. I, I don't like it. So um, Okay, so where does this bring us to Endgame, Mr. Well, that's what I was saying. I feel like this movie was just like, I feel like we've established the cast of like what this franchise is and we've moved in a direction. And then I feel like this is just, I don't know, I feel like they just tried to shove this one in before Endgame. I'm not really sure why. Um, I thought felt, it was kind of cool with the backstory. Like we got to know about- Nick I didn't think Curry's, it was cool. And we got to know more about Nick Fury, which was cool to me. That part was cool. I, I like the Nick Fury part. I like seeing Colston. I, I did think it was a really fun movie, but every movie that I've seen, I sort of felt like, okay, there's a purpose to this. You know, maybe we, like, was the whole purpose of this movie was just to explain how the Kree are actually innocent or something? Like, what No, was I think the, the purpose was to show that she's, like, one with space or one up there. Like, she knows a lot of, about stuff up there. So we just basically needed another, like, Star Wars character. So we, we needed... Need, did he disappear? Yeah, he did disappear. Okay, so we we just were basically using our resources and the only resource nick fury knew to hit up was her it just felt weird because i've never heard of this character and she just came out of nowhere to me as well i mean yeah say. that's why i was kind of thinking like no one would really like you know when people are like oh it's bs this movie well i was thinking maybe because it was like an origin story right before endgame but it was like actually a necessary origin story like she's a comic book character oh she's a real comic book yes. character okay see i didn't know that okay there we go so i didn't know that captain marvel was a comic book character i just thought like i've never heard of her i thought she came out of left field so you know that makes sense well she's a comic book character then of course she should make her way onto the film. Okay. Well, my thing is, why so late? You know what I'm saying? Why because did it Nick take Curry so sent long? the message, and she said, "Hit me up if necessary." So this whole time she's just been out there chilling. I guess so, helping those people. Really good movie. I had a lot of fun watching it though. I thought the graphics of the movie were really vibrant and awesome. Uh, it was funny. It was a really funny movie. If you guys are new to the journey, you know when we first started watching this, I wasn't the biggest fan of Captain America because right. Captain America was very like stale and almost had like it was kind of boring, right? And this lady was coming across the same as me. Like she was just giving me Captain America vibes, but her personality definitely picked. Up. But you know, Captain well, she America. She said it herself she didn't up. know who she was. Right. So that could be a lot of it. That was a really fun movie. We'll be back with Endgame. Let's go.